Hey everybody, today we're gonna to be looking at a Keystone Avalanche model number 372MB, fifth wheel. Now for specs and pricing, check the dealership's website, which will be down in the description below. Let's get started. Well, right up front behind your pin box, you're gonna have some storage area. This is prepped for a generator if you would like to add one. Um, here is your access panel for your hydraulics. Coming on down the side, you're gonna have a nice large pass-through storage area. And this is on a drop frame, so it's gonna give you more space. You have a nice large power awning with an LED light strip. So let's go inside and take a look. Coming into this avalanche, um, in the kitchen area, you're gonna have a really nice, um, can be used as a coffee station or small appliances, whatever you need. Very nice solid surface countertop storage up above wow. lots of storage down below wow. very nice backsplash this is going to have a residential samsung refrigerator mm. with freezer on the bottom coming on into the kitchen area you're going to have a three burner cooktop with an oven and storage down below. Right above it is your microwave and some storage right up above that. Mm -hmm. Here on your island, you'll see that it also has solid surface countertop, high rise faucet over a 60-40 sink. Ooh, solid surface. Yes, those are very nice. Right down below that, you got another bank of drawers. Uh, pull out for your two garbage cans and some storage right under the sink. They also do give you a drawer underneath your oven. Coming around to your entertainment center. Right down here, you have a very nice electric fireplace. Your sound system here, right next to your TV. And you do have a couple of storage areas right up above it. At the back of your coach, you're gonna have a trifold sofa that will make into additional sleeping if you need it. You have got um, arm table uh, tables on both sides with wireless charging for your phone, and that is on both sides. Up above your sofa, you have some um, cabinet areas and some shelving. And here is one of your three AC units, and you'll see that there is a ceiling fan. Nice large windows around the back. This would be beautiful for lakeside camping. Coming on to the camp side of your coach, you're gonna have your theater seating. It's gonna have uh, power reclining. You do have cup holders and some storage right there. Beautiful large windows, slow rise shades. Mm. Absolutely wonderful. Next to this is gonna be your freestanding table and chairs. You'll see that there's not a leg under there. That's great, so you won't hit your knees. Seating for four. Your second AC is also going to be in the kitchen and living area. Coming down the hall, we will go into the uh, bunk room, or you can use this as an office. You'll see that this is going to uh, be a trifold sofa to let out into more sleeping, mm -hmm. plus you have a bunk over it. On this side, you have storage. This can be used as a second bedroom. You can use this as an office. You do have a place here that you can hook up a TV if you desire. This is some of that Down storage here. from the living room. Yes, this is going to be the back of your, um, like your coffee bar, that area. Yep. Coming right on 
down the hall. Right here, they do give you some hooks so you can hang your keys up, place for your coats. Excellent location. Right up the stairs, we'll go into the bathroom. This is gonna have two entries. Now, Jeremy's right about six feet tall, so mm -hmm. with the skylight, plenty of headroom. There is very little step up to get into the shower, and this is a molded one-piece one shower. Yep. And right over here, you've got your medicine cabinet, above a nice size sink, a little bit of storage down here below it, and your foot flush toilet is at a very good angle. Oh, and there's more storage. There we go. There we go. Okay, you have two entries in this bathroom. Uh, bathroom. This one goes into the bedroom, and I am going to come through the hall. This is going to have a king size bed on a slide. You have windows on both sides that will open for ventilation. You've got some little tables on both sides. You do have storage underneath your bed. At the foot of the bed, you're going to have a chest with five drawers. Yep. Very nice. And your TV will mount right up here and your hookups are there if you want to add another TV. Right here, you have a little bench. Got some additional storage down in there. This unit is gonna have a nice large closet here at the front, and it is prepped for a washer and dryer. All right, folks, if you like this fifth wheel, the dealership's information and website. Check the website for the specs and for pricing on this unit. So, and like always, if you just found our channel, go ahead and subscribe and follow along with us. Thanks, everybody.